Welcome back to my channel, you guys. I wanted to do a quick video on how to make juicy boneless chicken breasts in the oven. And it's a really simple recipe or trick. So we're just gonna start with a baking dish, or at least that's what I use. And I always line mine with foil. So you wanna get that all around there. Now that we have our dish foil lined, I'm gonna go ahead and grab my chicken. So I marinate my chicken and I have an oil-based marinade. Um, for most of my marinades, they're oil-based. So um, this has been sitting for 24 hours. You don't have to marinate your meats for 24 hours. I just do, um, but I'm just gonna take this and try to get the meat to lay inner boob down, if that makes any sense. So. See if I can slide it out of the bag without getting any of it on my hands. I also uh, typically use gloves when I deal with chicken because I don't want to get the salmo. So it's really a personal preference. But if you don't have an oil-based marinade, you can go ahead and just use um, a little bit of oil at the bottom of or um, of your foil lining. And I was trying to get some of the seasoning out just because I'm a seasoning hoarder. But yeah, don't reuse these bags. Throw them away because salmo. All right, so now I'm gonna take a little bit of water and this is just what I do. I do put, um, I don't know, I have about one fourth cup of water in here. I don't actually use it all here. I typically eyeball it, but you wanna just kinda get some of that water in there. And that, um, I don't know if I wanna say it creates a steaming effect, but um, it, it helps my chicken breast not come out dry. And I'm just gonna take a little bit more foil Go ahead and cover the top of this baking dish. And I try to seal it as much as possible. Sometimes I'm rushing and don't have enough foil, but it'll be fine. Just cover it up and you're all good to go for the oven. And my oven is preheated for 350. I have an electric oven, so I am going to have my chicken in here for about an hour because my oven is old and I need a new oven. But for you, 30 to 45 minutes will do. So I'm gonna go ahead and check on it. And like, again, because my oven is kind of janky, I and I don't wanna get Salmo, I definitely check my chicken before taking it out, so. And be careful doing this, there's steam, as you can see. So that's what we have going on here. And I'm gonna get a fork and a knife just to cut into it so I can see if it's pink on the inside still. You definitely want to check that, especially when you have thicker chicken breasts. Now these chicken breasts aren't super duper thick, but I've had some where it's like, oh my God, it takes forever to bake through. So yeah, if not, just put the foil back on and pop it back in the oven. But these babies here are ready to come out. All right, so that's pretty much it, you guys. I mean, really easy peasy. Take your chicken, marinate it, put it in a foil lined baking dish, put a little bit of water in there, you know, cover it with foil and voila, you're done. And hopefully you won't burn your kitchen down, but I have faith in you. Anyways, if you like this content, please feel free to subscribe and share this with anybody that is wanting to know how to make juicy chicken breasts. Thanks for watching you guys and I will catch you next time. Bye.